Valerie Molay. Hello, hello. <laughs> Actually, I'm so proud to be here to make history with each one of you. I'm so happy and like I didn't expect it to be this big and I'm telling you I'm fitting in the energy. Thank you for that. <laughs> Thank you. I'm here representing a migrant organization. We are a feminist, we are a human rights based and a migrant led organization. Yeah. We in the Kidua, we promote equality, we promote justice, uh, for all migrants in Ireland. As we like to say all the time, before being a migrant, we are women. Before being women, we are human beings. And it is exactly for that reason that we, we stand here in solidarity with each one of you to repeal the Eighth Amendment. I gotta tell you the truth. I'm sort of fed up and I'm sort of angry. And I'll tell you why I'm angry. Because last year, on this right same spot, we spoke about, we expressed our concern about a system that put its women at risk. We spoke about how women in direct provision, we spoke about how we're undocumented women, we spoke about how women that even had the paper, but that still have to go through visa process, telling you that they felt humiliated, they felt embarrassed, they felt powerless, basically they felt at the mercy of this racist system. And we say, enough is enough. As one woman that I love so much once says, Rosa Park, I have learned over the years that when one's mind is made up, this diminishes fear. Knowing what must be done does away with fear. So I'm right here telling all the politicians of Ireland that women of Ireland, men of Ireland, young women, young men have made up their mind. And we say we're not backing down because we have no more fear until the Eighth Amendment is repealed. We are not going anywhere until you repeal the Eighth Amendment. Enough is enough and knowing the human rights of women, enough is enough putting us down, enough is enough humiliating us. This is the time for change. And one last message, as you all probably don't realize, I'm really young. And I'm the youngest board member of Akirua. And we, at the moment, we're promoting young people to come out and speak out. Because I tell you one thing I realized in my life, all the generation before us has come out and paved the way. Young people, it is our time to come and seal the deal. It is our time to stand up out there, take the mantle, and let's change the world. So I tell you, let's repeal the Eighth Amendment. <laughs>